Why give a shrimp a stun gun? A species profile of the pistol shrimp. The pistol shrimp lives along the bottom of shallow, tropical seafloors throughout the Atlantic Ocean from California to Brazil and the West Indies. It uses its half-inch claw, which is about half the size of its entire body length, to dig a deep, extensive hole in the soft floors that it con is constantly improving and using to protect itself from predators. Pistol shrimp are usually residents of coral reefs, underwater grass flats, and oyster reefs, though there are some species that can be found in freshwater caves. Male pistol shrimps can be identified by their pistol claws, which are larger than the pos those possessed by females. Pistol shrimps appear to be monogamous, mating in single pairs throughout their lifespan. The male shrimp guards his female mate fiercely, preventing other males from mating with her. Initially, a male and female pistol shrimp will hold an aggressive face-off for about an hour and then will mutually submit to one another for lifelong mating. Once mated, a male and female pistol shrimp will share a shelter together. To reproduce, the male puts its sperm into a gelatinous sac in between the female's fourth pair of legs. Then the female lays about 15,000 eggs. Once a female pistol shrimp lays her eggs, they hatch about 28 days later. Pistol shrimp larvae grow in three stages. The first one lasts one to two hours, the second lasts 28 hours, and the entire process from laying to hatching takes only four to five days. Adult pistol shrimps can reach a length of three to five and a half centimeters. They are generally much smaller than that, however, averaging between 6 and 20 millimeters long. While most species of pistol shrimp appear to be monogamous, some species tend to cluster in large colonies that reach their peak densities in June and July and wane thereafter. Pistol shrimp use their sonic claws to stun and kill worms, small shrimp, crabs, and other crustaceans. Speaking of the specialized claw, the pistol shrimp snaps its claw shut to create a cavitation bubble that generates acoustic pressures of up to 80 kilopascals at a distance of 4 centimeters from the claw. As it extends out from the claw, the bubble reaches speeds of 60 miles per hour and releases a sound reaching 218 decibels. The pressure is strong enough to kill a small fish. The snap also can produce sonoluminescence from the collapsing cavitation bubble. As it collapses, the cavitation bubble reaches temperatures of over 4,700 Celsius. In comparison, the surface temperature of the sun is estimated to be about 5,500 Celsius. The light is of low intensity than the light produced by typical sonoluminescence and is not visible to the naked eye. It is most likely a byproduct of the shock wave with no biological significance. However, it was the first known instance of an animal producing light by this effect. It has subsequently been discovered that another group of crustacean, the mantis shrimp, contains species whose club-like forelimbs can strike so quickly and with such force as to induce sonoluminescence cavitation bubbles upon impact. This specialized claw is used for hunting as well as for communication. When feeding, the shrimp usually lies in an obscure spot such as a burrow. The shrimp then extends its antenna outwards to determine if fish are passing by. Once it feels movement, the shrimp inches out of its hiding place, pulls back its claws, and releases a shot which stuns the prey. The shrimp then pulls it to the burrow and feeds. Pistol shrimp interact minimally with humans, whether their interactions are active or infertile. Pistol shrimp can be kept as pets in home aquariums and are exhibited in many public aquariums. There have also been several video studies done on pistol shrimps and their abilities to shoot rapid water jets with their modified pincer. Other video studies have been done and have been beneficial to physics and biological researchers, professors, and students. Areas where pistol shrimps occur at high densities are sometimes associated with interference for ship's sonar's capabilities. The loud pops made by firing of the modified pistol claws at the shrimps living at high densities rivals that of the sound of sperm whales and beluga whale calls. Thus, they have been called the loudest animals in the ocean. As for ecological importance, the pistol shrimp has been found to not be a major prey item for most species in the tropical communities. In fact, it only acts as a predator and has been found to have symbiotic relationships with different types of gobies. The gobies will act as the seeing eye dog, as the pistol shrimp acts as the burrow cleaner.